In a previous tutorial, we went over how you could change the colors of objects in photos using HSL adjustments. But in this tutorial, we'll be going over how you can replace every instance of a single color as it relates to vector objects on your workspace. So my example here, I have this array of vector objects. If I wanted to change every instance of this color right here, all I would have to do is select it and then come up here to the select menu and go to select same and choose fill color. Now, if you want to select objects based on their stroke color, then you would choose stroke color instead. But in my example, it's based on fill color. So I'll choose fill color. And when you do that, it's going to select every other object on your canvas that has that fill color. And now you can change the color there, as you can see like that. And now I could just go through and repeat this process for every other variation of that color as well. And just like that, I was able to change the colors of all of those objects without having to select them one by one. And the benefit of using this approach is that it actually changes the color of the object, as opposed to just using an HSL adjustment where it just applies a filter that changes the appearance of the color. So that's how you can find and replace colors using Affinity Designer.